running out of light The time is changing day to night Lines are fading out So I am trying something new I am going to do my normal videos like I always do But I'm going to add little vlogs and so I will label them as a vlog so if that's not what you're interested in you can just skip right past it if you want but if you want to watch it you know what you're getting into I am eventually gonna open up another channel because I do so much woodworking and shop work and stuff like that it's probably well it's absolutely gonna have nothing to do with travel so I am gonna open that at some point and I'll just add vlogs to this channel. Um, this is my office. This is where I work. My husband, he works over on the other side. And that's it. I hope you like it. Is this a vlog? It has begun. I am on my way to the property to do some winterization. And then I'm going to Utah. I'm gonna travel the entire state of Utah as much as I can. And I'm gonna bring you guys with me. So that's what's happening. I'm south of Boise right now. It's supposed to be 17 degrees there on Tuesday. And and I'll probably head out tomorrow or the next day and enjoy myself have some fun I'm by myself I didn't even bring my dogs because I was afraid they just get my and having two dogs for two three weeks inside of a forerunner when they're muddy is not ideal so yeah everything's packed I brought my drone I'm gonna practice my drone tonight I've never even used it I got it for Christmas last year so that's what I'm gonna do um, I'm gonna go soak in tonight at Kyle Hot Spring. You can guys do that with me. I've showed that one to you already before. I found these funky glasses at Walmart and I absolutely love them. So that's it. I enjoyed my McDonald's coffee this morning. I've been trying to find a Jackery. You can't find them. Everything is online ordering and nobody has them in store. I tried Lowe's, Home Depot, Walmart, and they all have knockoffs, but they don't actually have a Jackery. So Jackery, if you're watching this, I have no sponsors and you can do my first. And I will live forever. But yeah, that's it. been a long day and night I'll tell you that much right now it's been quite an ordeal but I got a new selfie stick and I can't remember what kind it is so we're gonna I guess find out together um, I'm in the fifth wheel at the property Don't cut yourself, don't cut yourself. I always cut myself. If you guys know me personally, you know that. Okay. So I have been having such bad problems with my camera, with my phone shaking all the time. And this selfie stick well, my husband saw this selfie stick at a Bronco off-roading um, expedition class. He's getting a new Bronco coming up, the 2021 Bronco. I cannot open this. I'm completely going to destroy the box. Holy cow, I'm afraid of breaking it. Don't even, sorry about the lighting, it's all I got right now. 
Um, oh, there we go. Now we're now we're doing something. But you're supposed to. God, I don't know how it works. I will read the directions. But your phone is supposed to stay level, and you can somehow <laughs> one of these buttons will like make it go from horizontal to vertical. So yeah, a charging device. No clue, no clue. Have no clue what that is. But this is the Osmo Mobile 3. I have no good or bad things to say about it because I haven't used it. And I don't read directions, but this time I will. Okay. I'll show you how that works later when I figure it out on my next video. I'll do that. So, got all my instructions. Oh, and it comes with a bag. Keep it in, which is extremely handy. Okay. Now, this is what's up. Went to Kyle Hot Spring last night. And I met this fella named Steve. Thank you for subscribing. He subscribed yesterday. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And he had found this dog on the road. And it's not hit or nothing. It's just out there sitting. And the first time I went by, it was there. Followed him a while. And then when he came back later, it was still there laying in the middle of the road. So... Of course, we gathered him up and put him inside of my vehicle. You know where this is headed? So now I have this dog and it was not hungry. I'm pretty stinking sure it lives around here. And I have somebody's dog at my house and they're probably looking for it. And he's a sweetheart and I fed him and I took care of him, but he need his owners need to find him because he's a good dog and i'm feeling really bad right now but i don't know where he goes i don't know where he actually was originally picked up at and i went up okay my shape so this is my little sign i had to cover up my phone number i'm going to walk up to the end of the driveway with said dog and put that in of my driveway with rock on it and pray to God that somebody comes for their dog. Otherwise, I may have three dogs because he's really sweet. I call him Kyle because, you know, Kyle Hot Spring. Better than calling him dog. So, yep, I'll let you meet him. He's so sweet. So you're getting the lighting from my computer and that's all you get. So that's that. Um, is this a vlog? I mean, I'm not really showing you anything except for my day. So I think it's a vlog. Um, I'll give you a little update on the dog. I met with the owners at the end of the driveway and they took him home. And once he was home, I got a message that said that it is not their dog. Just like their dog, but it's not theirs. So they are kind enough to take him until um, an owner is found. And if the owner is not found, they're willing to keep him. So he will not go to the pound. We are doing everything we can to find the rightful owners though. So 
Um, I'm leaving tomorrow for Utah. I will be... Can't tell you where I'll be because that's not safe. But I am leaving for Utah tomorrow morning. Good night. It's very late. And... Hmm. I don't know. Daydream.